Dear ladies and gentlemen, in this video guide I will tell you about uh, absolutely free removal of Prudent Search Browser Hijacker. Now, as you see, my video shows Prudent Search to hijack both browsers, Google Chrome and Safari in Mozilla Firefox. The peculiarity of Prudent Search is that it only attacks Mac-related browsers. You need to be careful when you have noticed that Prudent Search has hijacked your default home page. Not only the home page is hijacked, but the default search engine and the new tab URL is also changed by this hijacker. For instance, when you attempt to open the new tab in Google Chrome, you notice this Prudent Search to appear uh, every time and you cannot really change to your blank tab well because it is no longer blank but changed to prudent search similarly the uh, infection has spread into the uh, search engine if you used to have google search as your default and primary search engine now it's changed to some other search engine for instance when you submit some search queries you notice that the results are delivered by some unfamiliar Opti page or if we do that in Safari browser the results are delivered by Yahoo first of all how can we fix this issue of course it's important to realize that it's better to prevent the attack of prudent search than to look for the ways of its elimination after the attack became successful you need to carefully examine the list of your available Mac applications. So, go to your Mac applications, inspect the elements that look suspicious here, and get rid of them manually by right-clicking on them and moving them to the trash. Also, you may um, inspect your Google Chrome settings in terms of its home page, and the default search engine. Uh, here it's set to prudent search, however the problem is that you cannot change it. And uh, there is a reason why you cannot change it, by the way. You need to access uh, system preferences in your Mac and to check the profiles icon. Here you will find several profiles that may be related to prudent search. So, when you find them, make them highlighted and remove them. You will need to provide your administrator password for this purpose. And uh, make sure you get rid of all these related profiles one at a time. So, once they are all removed and deleted, uh, the problem should be fixed, well, at least partially. But the key to fixing this issue is definitely in getting rid of these unwanted profiles. Now, once this has been done, I also recommend that you perform additional of scanning of your Mac with a um, Combo Cleaner antivirus. You may get it on the official website System Tips. Uh, .net slash download combo cleaner so this is the link system-tips.net download dash combo dash cleaner combo cleaner is a great anti-malware tool that can help you fix all your other Mac issues that can be in place so download the application using this link system-tips.net slash download dash combo dash cleaner Install the software and start the application through your launchpad. The initial manual solution I have explained is absolutely free. You do not need to pay for any program. Now, Combo Cleaner in its premium version will help you to remove all other possible threats and fix other browser-related issues. Let's say you might have some other adware or browser hijacker still enabled. So Combo Cleaner will help to detect these um, issues for free during its scan. So click on Start Combo Scan button. 
Now, I remember that Combo Cleaner is not a free program, but to remove threads, the premium license is required. However, if you want to keep your Mac clean and protected, Combo Cleaner Premium is the great solution in this case. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe to my channel and share the video if it was uh, helpful to you.